Hello and welcome to another Aggies Beers, Wines and Spirits review. On a not a bad Sunday morning really. Don't remember much of last night, I did a beer review, uh, a Doppia Molto review. Went in, fell asleep, got a bollock enough to wife this morning for it. So, how'd you do? So, from Big Drop Brewing Company, it's their alcohol free beer, 0. Point, what's that? Less than 0.5% and it's a galactic milk stout. Alcohol free. I've never seen um, a stout that's alcohol free. So, we'll... Good dark pour to it. And just like any stout, you know, it, it looks the part, doesn't it? It's got that near black colour with that deep dark tan head on the aroma. Definite milk on the aroma. Coffee, roastiness, chocolate. So it's all there. The elements so far. The look, the aroma. And uh, better than smelling bloody tea on the aroma, I tell you. Because I'm not keen on any of them uh, alcohol freeze. That smell of tea. Isn't I don't know why this smell of tea, what what the reason is for it. But I don't like it. So yes, it's a bit too much to drink yesterday. I had nothing all day. Uh, got up, had the old um did two gardens, come back, I'd last had the previous nights half the chicken kebab that I couldn't eat. Chuff that down, went up to my brothers, had some up past thirteen. Two glasses of that, then a glass of Cronenberg, and then a glass of red, Isla Negra, and then he got out this blueberry gin. And I says, Look, uh, put it back in the bottle, I'll take a turn with me. No, 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 no. Fucking drank that dinner. I felt battered after that. And then I finished off with a bit of Wolf Blast Red Label, and uh, I was well on my way then. Well on my way. And then what did I do? Come home, do a quick beer haul video. Reviewed Peroni's Doppio Malta, and that was it. I'd been breached. The, the, the alcohol consumption was was that too much. And uh, you win some, you lose some. And that, I lost it last night. Fell asleep and, uh, yeah, got a moaned at. This morning, it's fair play. She's totally right for moaning, so, you know. Sometimes you let life get hold of you. Best not to let life get hold of you. So, the head's dissipated quite quickly. Um, reason I'm doing a beer review this early in the morning, just after 8 in the morning, that's early for a beer review, but it's alcohol free, which is why I'm doing it, uh, is the fact that we're going to the cinema today to watch Guardians of the Galaxy. And uh, might do a beer review later in the afternoon, but for the most part of my day, I'll be busy. So the aroma is exactly what you would expect. I can tell it's not alcoholic straight away. But the taste elements, the aroma, the look, pretty much bang on. You know, it's as close as you're going to get to a stout without being an alcoholic stout. good that really is good fair play to big drop brewing company if you're going to get people to, to, to go on to uh, alcohol free and low alcohol you've got to make it taste near enough the same because uh, what's the point otherwise you know you might as well just drink cola uh, which is probably cheaper well, I don't know I don't know these days in pubs and uh, chuffing wind um, but yeah, if you're going to do it, you've got to make it uh, worthwhile to the drinker. To f so it fools them into thinking that they're drinking something that's um, just decorating the wall. That it's something that it's wor worth trying. And uh, this is definitely there. It's got all the elements. 
all the alcohol. Nice bitterness, a roasty bitterness in the background. Wow, what a classic of a of a beer. Can't make that lighting on the back in this light. It's not light enough in here for that. I need a light above me that shines down so I can actually read stuff. Then all you'd probably see is my head. And it's not the best. I love them days when I had a lot of air up there. I still do when I leave it to grow. It's just the fact that there's, a, there's, a, there's, that, there's that bit in the bloody middle. Eh? So annoying. So I paid £1.30 for this and I've got to say um, it's a World Beer Award winner as well, silver. And I've got to say that that is amazing for, for alcohol free. Um, and what we, Bex Blue, the Copperberg alcohol free ciders. Um, there's the odd lager as well as that and obviously um, Brew Dogs. IPA. There is a good range of um, alcohol free slash low alcohol stuff that um, you know for all drinkers really. Um, I've never tried alcohol free wine. Um, I tried slur but that's not really alcohol free it's just it's just pop. But um, it just goes to show you what's out there. There's some really really they've obviously they've come on over the years a lot better than what they used to be. And uh, yeah, very, very good. A taste, a taste without overcompensating. Great aroma, without smelling like tea. And overall, there's nothing you can really fault it on. By the fact it's got no alcohol in, but it, that's what it is. Um, yeah. Absolute classic. Well pleased with that. Just finish the last little bit. So what? what there's no you can say about it. It's absolutely balmy. Fantastic. So like I said, poured it out. Looks like a start dark colour, and they're black with that strong tan head. The tan head dissipated on the nose. Milk, chocolate, coffee, roastiness, and then that all translated into the taste. And overall, bloody good all the way down. No fault in it at all. So, quite astoundingly, that was amazing. And that's it's better than some beers that are behind me on this wall that I've got alcohol in. It's got everything you would ask of a normal beer, but no alcohol. Wow. Out of five of them, for me, an absolute classic straight away. 4.7 out of five. We're talking probably this in the top three or four of what's out there for low alcohol slash alcohol free beers and lager ciders. That is a stunner. And that's it from this beer review. Um, I might do a couple later in the day, as long as I don't drink too much and pee the wife off again. But um, yeah, you know, you have to you have to keep pressing the buttons every now and again, and I do seem to do that a little bit too often. But there you go. Thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing. See you soon. Stay safe. Cheers.